So Turtle Beach has a brand new headset and it's called the Elite Pro 2. The successor to the Elite Pro and I have it here, I'm using it with the Elite Pro uh, 2 and the Super app. Now this is the Xbox version, this is the Xbox and Windows version and then there's a PlayStation version which also works for Windows as well. Now um, the Xbox version is white, it's an all white headset with uh, black leather ear cups and you can get it with the super amp all retail for about 249 so this is their top tier headset there are a lot of things on this headset i do have to talk about that really um has got me quite fired up now the first thing first is just of course the super amp let's talk about that before we get to the main headset now the super amp is pretty unique in the fact that um it connects via usb it uses uh, micro usb not mini usb so mini usb not micro usb i apologize it does have bluetooth capabilities so you can pair it to your smartphone because it's an app we'll get to that in a second it's a large volume dial on the top which lights up there's a light up logo of turtle beach and also the volume and of course you've got an output there so you can actually go ahead and stream now the cool thing about connecting to your smartphone is that when you do that um you are paired to your smartphone via bluetooth for two reasons one you can answer phone calls while you're gaming you can answer a call boom no problem the second thing is also using the application that's where turtle beach has done more with the app and taking a lot of that stuff uh, away from uh the super amp physical super amp itself so you go into the app you've got a couple of capabilities that are pretty nice so you've got everything you know from your mic monitoring there you can also change the lighting on the uh super amp as well so you can go ahead and do that uh you can change you know the color variations you can also do your superhuman hearing through that as well uh you've got the full breadth of functionalities that you would expect you can uh, boost your chat you can also go through the, the presets of sound you can uh mix your game and chat volume so all that's there on the application while you're using it so um, you can use it directly off your phone and um, it's it's pretty nice like I first thought okay why not just have it on the super amp and I, I kind of I kind of like what they're doing with it they're moving away from that now you've got really nice lengthy cables so when you're connected to your xbox you want to sit back in your tv about 10 feet you can do that quite well and also that adds the one of the benefits for it because you're on your xbox and because you're going to be away from where the super amp is you can basically do everything on that now the one thing i will say that i was not really a big fan of is the fact that the mute button is on the cable so it's on the, on the cable that connects to your headset which is fine but i just wish it was either on the headset itself or maybe you know i can do that um i'd rather just you know just keep that on the application itself now moving to the headset now the headset is really really interesting what i like about the headset is that you've got a couple of things uh, with it first of all this is probably one of the most comfortable headsets from um uh turtle beach it's it feels more comfortable it's got a nice degree tilt so you can actually wear it for a long time I've, I've i've gamed for about at least two hours straight where i felt really comfortable and just really no stress with it now in terms of other features it's got a cooling gel so it feels really cool when you wear it which is nice though so like it doesn't feel uh like it's burning your ears or anything like that like it doesn't feel too warm um uh, 50 uh millimeter nano clear drivers so really nice pristine sound and you guys who are looking for of course your footsteps and things like that it comes out really well with this headset uh it also supports surround sound uh, for the xbox one so it supports the virtual surround sound windows sonic as well so when you connect to your pc uh that those features are there now the headband itself is nice and comfortable it does uh shift and connect so that's actually pretty good uh, you've got this very um, different design um, nomenclature so one that allows for glasses relief so if you wore glasses you can actually go ahead and slide them into uh, the sides there so you can wear them comfortably because there's enough spacing to allow your glasses to fit um, this is one of the things that I really like about this headset that it, it just feels really nice like Turtle Beach has done their homework and said Let's build you something. So while you're gaming, you're playing your favorite game, when you're playing something like a Call of Duty, uh, you're getting all those rich sounds, footsteps, everything comes out really clear. I do like this headset quite a lot. The one thing I'll say on the downside is that it still feels heavier than I would like. Uh, it's not too heavy. It's much lighter than previous uh, Total Beach headsets and it's much more comfortable, but I still want them to cut down some of that weight. 
That being said, it is built very sturdy. You can feel the metal. So the, around the top, it's solid metal. At least, uh, at least the metal build is really nice. The plastic build is one where you shake your head that it feels like things are rattling on the headset. Now, on your left ear cup is the connector for the microphone as well as also the uh, cable for uh, uh, audio as well. Uh, now the mic, as you guys have heard it throughout this whole video, because uh, this recording has been done off the Turtle Beach headset. And now you can see me fully. I'm actually using this headset to record the audio. And I have to say though, I'm quite impressed. It blocks out a lot of background noise. Uh, which is great because if you especially if this is a pro headset you think about tournaments and things like that you want to take this with you uh, This blocks out a lot of noise, which is really really good I've also had it on, on phone calls. I remember the first time I set it up and uh, a friend called me up and I was like Oh, this is perfect. I can definitely test out the headset like you know, and they're like what headset? I'm like, can you hear me? Does it sound like a headset? They're like no, it sounds like a regular phone call So it, it does a good job there and I'm also using it on PC and uh, I think it sounds really robust uh, 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 my air condition is kicked in and I left it on for a purpose just to see if it actually um, interferes with the sound of this recording but I think overall for me though I do like what Turtle Beach has done here I think they've really come a long way in changing some of the things now I forgot to mention this also supports Adobe Atmos on the Xbox one so if your Xbox one user I'm picking this up uh, this will go a long way but I think a lot of people will like this headset because it brings a lot more to the table for what Turtle Beach has done uh, one thing though I think it, they still need to drop down on weight but I think in terms of audio, they've done a really good job. And I also think um, um, they've also got, done a good job with the microphone as well. The other thing I would like them to change is also the volume. Now the volumes, uh, uh, you can mess around with the EQs to get better sound volume, but I think the volumes are just a little bit too low. Uh, I think they can, you know, tune that up with the software update. That's just my own preference though. So I think it might differ with, with other people, but I like it. Anyway, if you're looking for a gaming headset to pick up, I think this is one you can definitely go ahead and have out and pick up. This is the Turtle Beach Elite Pro 2, successor to the Elite Pro 1. Some of you will be thinking, why not uh, uh, another, you know, um, game DAC like they had, a really nice DAC with the EQ controls and all that. And I think that was great. I really like that. I think that was just more for the pro user, the you know, the heavy gamer that goes to a lot of tournaments. That really works out well. I think this one here with the super amp here really does a good job in setting a nice standard plus the application really goes a long way on Android and iOS that you can pick up. So there you have it guys. If you're looking for this headset, go ahead and use our link down below. Otherwise, don't forget to like and share this video, favorite this video, subscribe to the channel and always enjoy your entertainment.